Good morning, everyone. Thank you for joining us today. My name is Alexandra Campbell. I'm the Executive Director of the Reston Historic Trust and Museum. And today we're launching a new series, Museum from Home, where each Monday morning we'll be posting videos. You'll be seeing artifacts from our collection and going on virtual tours. If you would like to leave us a comment about what you would like to see in the upcoming weeks, please do so, and let's get started. Today we're going to be talking about this beautiful painting. This is a fairly new acquisition for us. It was donated to the museum last year. It is a painting of Reston Avenue and was created by Bertie Poston in 1925. So who was Bertie Poston? Roberta May Poston, known as Bertie, was born March 16, 1895. She was born when the area we call Reston was called Wheelie. If you didn't know already, that's how the street in Metro got its name. Bertie's father, Jackson Lee Poston, worked at the Bowman Distillery. He had moved here in 1891 and Bertie was born in 1895. She lived her entire life in Reston and here we have a few images of her that were published in The Connection. This artifact is also in our collection as well. Bertie attended several schools throughout her life. The first school she attended was a one-room schoolhouse in Wheelie. At 16, she went to the Herndon Seminary School, which was a private school for girls where she studied piano. Playing piano would turn into a lifelong passion. She would later play piano at her church. She did not attend Herndon High School, but she taught herself to type and got a position working in the general's office downtown in Washington, D.C. She would work downtown until she retired at the age of 69 in 1964, when the first residents of Reston were moving in. Piano was not her only passion. She loved drawing and painting as well. She studied drawing at the Cochrane School of Art, and that brings us back to the painting we are looking at today. As I mentioned, this is a painting of Reston Avenue where Bertie's house was. It's rather difficult to see, but if you look at the lower right-hand corner of this painting, you can see Bertie has signed her name as well as the year 1925. On the left here, we've blown up a portion of the painting so you can see it in more detail, including the brush strokes of Bertie's paintbrush. We hope you enjoyed today's artifact highlight. Please check out our website, restinmuseum.org, to browse the rest of our collection, view our past publications and programs, and much, much more. Please also consider making a donation at restinmuseum.org slash donation to support our mission of preserving and sharing Reston's history. Again, please let us know what you would like to see in the upcoming weeks and join us next Monday for new content.